Hey there on YouTube. Welcome to the set of the NFL Mashup Show. I'm Sal Palantonio. That is the yeah. founding father of our show, Greg Cosell. And this is Mr. Darius Butler. We start with the number one team in the National Football <laughs> League. I like the way that sounds. The Philadelphia <laughs> Eagles, the only unbeaten team in the NFL going into week four. And Jalen Hurts, number one in the NFL in yards per pass attempt. Very important statistic. And also number one in offense overall, the Philadelphia Eagles. So let's take a look specifically at what Hurts is doing in the passing game. He is a defense's worst nightmare. You have a gifted quarterback, a talented quarterback like that, that can do all the basic quarterback things, right? The pre-snap reads, going through progressions, making throws from the pocket. And then when he gets off script, that's when he's special. And he's doing it. And obviously talent matters too. They went out and got some great guys, obviously drafted Devontae Smith, traded for A.J. Sure. Brown. So talent around a guy matters. Offensive line gives them time to go through those reads. I mean, everything you want in a quarterback, Jalen Hurts has given you. It's early in the season. Defenses will try to start figuring him out a little bit more. But I think he'll continue to get better and better. And it goes back to what you were talking about. Coaching matters yep. in this specific instance and for the Jacksonville Jaguars. Doug Peterson has calmed down that entire team. Brought what we what Jeffrey Lurie once called when he hired him to replace Chip Kelly. Mm -hmm. Emotional intelligence yeah. to that football team, right? And you can see it in the way they're running their offense. Yeah, and you see it with Trevor Lawrence in particular because when you watch the tape through three games and it's incremental and there'll be setbacks here and there but what you see Sal is he's quicker with his feet on his drop and his set he's not striding as much so therefore his delivery is a little more compact because yep. he had a tendency to overstride and have a longer delivery and that's essential in a Doug Peterson pass game where there is a lot of quick rhythm quick timing throws so you can see the development and growth yeah let's not forget about Mike Caldwell their defensive coordinator right He's doing a really good job. They're number one in rush defense in the National yep. Football League. They've got eight takeaways already. They had nine all of last year on defense. So they're doing a really good job at that defense. Yeah, I think giving them less than 13 points right yeah. now, too. And obviously, you go out and get number one pick with Walker. You go out and get Devin Lloyd, who's playing great. Just great players all around. Once again, talent matters. Coaching matters. These guys are physical. Josh Allen, the pick that he, first pick they took a few years ago, coming off the yeah, edge, wreaking player. havoc. So Mike Caldwell's doing a great job with these guys. But these players, they're buying in. Doug Peterson's leadership is showing uh, great things already. Well, how does that change the Eagles from an offensive perspective when you see that D in the way it's playing right now? Well, what you have is you have a lot of size and length up front, and you have speed at linebacker. You mentioned Mike Caldwell. What I think is really important here is what they're doing at linebacker. He came from Tampa. You know this well, Sal, where they had White and they had David, really good players. So what have they done? Now they have Oluokun and Lloyd. Fast players in the same yep. vein. So now what you have to do is you have to try to attack this defense, misdirection, get them playing because they want to play fast. Mm -hmm. So you need some misdirection elements so that you play with their eyes, you play with what they're seeing. And Eagles defensive coordinator Jonathan Gannon, much maligned Jonathan oh. Gannon from last year. He's obviously turned things around and primarily because he trusts who he has now in the secondary. Well, that's critical because their secondary now, they play a lot of zone, but match zone. Mm -hmm. And when you match, you have to carry and then pass on players. That takes time. They're doing that much better. Yeah, and they're really – deliver. Get, yeah. get, there getting you go. Get, <laughs> getting after deliver. the quarterback as a result. You trust your secondary, oh, yeah. right? Oh, yeah. And get after the quarterback. Oh, yeah, absolutely. You know something about that, don't you? It all, work, it all you? works together. It does work. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. It's the NFL Matchup Show. We're on YouTube. We're all over social media. You can catch us on ESPN and ESPN.